Hello and welcome back to another part of Asia Fundamental Series. Today I'm going to talk about capital and operational expenditure, how they differ from each other and which model is used in the cloud. Let's start with capital expenditure. Capital expenditure, also called as CAPEX, is basically purchasing an asset and paying for it upfront. This asset could be a server, storage, or even a networking equipment. With this comes maintenance as well. So you will be responsible for multiple activities like patching of the systems, replacing the faulty hardware, power, and networking of the equipments. And you'll also have to train staff to keep things operational. CAPEX is usually associated with on-premise infrastructure as you pay a large amount upfront for purchasing something and depreciate it over time. You also spend on its maintenance, which includes the activities which I just mentioned briefly. So as you can see on the graph on your screen, when we do a comparison of cost against time, you are doing an initial investment, you are spending a lot of money in setting up the infrastructure. And over time, this investment gradually goes down. When you are in the maintenance phase, you spend money on activities like maybe you'll have to replace a faulty hardware or you'll have to patch the system and so on. Buying capacity in this model means you initially buy a static capacity while keeping in mind a foreseeable future growth. So you don't start consuming everything as soon as you buy it, but start utilizing it over time. This results in a lot of capacity wastage as you largely don't consume it for a considerable, considerable amount of time, which is where operational expenditure is a better option. Operational expenditure or OPEX is about renting the infrastructure and cloud computing is largely associated with this model. Here you don't really need to do an initial investment and rather pay for what you use over time, which is why this model is also called as pay as you go or subscription model. So you, so you just pay for what you use. You don't really need to worry about the server capacity or any forecasting and get flexibility to scale up and down based on your requirements. And on top of it, you only get billed for what you use. Maintenance like patching of the underlying host, replacing failed hardware and so on is taken care by cloud vendor in this case, but you do need to take care of certain operational activities. This model basically provides you with more control over cost and enables you to be agile as infrastructure can be procured in just few clicks, which takes a lot of time when it comes to the CAPEX model. When you move from on-premise to cloud, then you make a move from CAPEX to OPEX. Let's summarize now by comparing both the models. When it comes to cost structure, then CAPEX has significant upfront cost, whereas OPEX doesn't have any upfront cost. OPEX does have an ongoing cost based on the amount of usage, whereas CAPEX has low ongoing costs in terms of maintenance. Now, as CAPEX requires large initial investment, so it has significant impact on your finances, whereas OPEX spreads this cost over time, so not a major impact on cost at once. You don't get much flexibility with CAPEX as you need to forecast the capacity and buy resources accordingly, whereas uh, OPEX enables you to be agile and scalable as the cloud provider has already planned for significant growth from end users. CAPEX has significant maintenance associated with it since you own the infrastructure and are responsible for its management, whereas OPEX has low ongoing maintenance associated with it. 
that's it for this part friends if you liked the content i have created then support the channel by hitting the subscribe button and sharing it in your network i'll see you in the next part of the series